Hi everyone, welcome back to a brand new video. I'm actually really excited about today's video. I'm going to share with you how I update my wardrobe to make sure that it feels current, that it has more of a modern feel to it, even though my style is very much minimal and classic. So the easiest way to update our wardrobes is to look at the trends. What trends are big for a specific season and usually it's easy to add one or two of those trends to your current wardrobe um, and basically whatever outfit you style with those pieces immediately feels up to date and a bit more fashion forward and on trend. Now there are definitely trends that I steer clear of and then there are trends that I focus on when I want to update my wardrobe. So the trends that I definitely steer clear of is number one color um, and as I said before there's nothing wrong with wearing color but I think you can really get swept up with the whole this color is in this season and then the next season that color is completely ignored and we're on to the next color so i don't really think there is a lot of longevity in only focusing on colors to update your wardrobe to make it feel a bit more modern so i stick to my neutrals this past winter i have dabbled with a bit of color as we all know burgundies and reds are really big so i have one or two pieces that I now and again add to an outfit but for the most part I still love my neutrals and I think that really never goes out of style it always feels modern and chic so I stick to neutrals and steer clear of the bright colors and the other trend kind of category that I don't use to update my wardrobe is any ornamental feature so anything that is a fringe or a ruffle maybe a bow um, those rosettes that were trendy last year so I keep my style still very much minimal um, and understated paired back so I typically don't go for any pieces that have any kind of ornamental embellishment on them now what I do focus on when I want to update my wardrobe is shape and I find that if I focus on shape then there's still a lot of longevity in the pieces that I buy they are still timeless I can wear them for years and years to come without feeling like oh my gosh everything in my wardrobe is completely out of date um, I think the reason is because we have so many different styles nowadays so there's not only one specific style of say a jacket that is on trend or in style there are a lot of different styles so no matter which one you pick no matter which one you wear chances are depending on how you style it it will still feel very modern and up to date um so i'm going to share with you the categories that i focused on to update my winter wardrobe i just quickly want to mention so the categories that i'm going to share with you today are specifically for winter i think i will do a similar video for spring and summer as well i think that would be really helpful and interesting and obviously in those there are some of these categories that won't be included and then there are some of them that will kind of overlap but please don't feel like you have to get all of these pieces to have an updated wardrobe um to have a wardrobe that feels current and a bit more modern you don't um i specifically chose these categories because there are pieces that most of us wear every day or a lot of days of the week um, so if you only update one of these pieces um, and it's something that you wear kind of every day or most days then that will mean almost all your outfits will feel a bit more updated so let's get started with the first category so one of everyone's favorite items in their wardrobe probably and that is jeans I just love a good pair of jeans um, I actually had to consciously stop buying jeans at some point last year because I just had too many but um, I just love different styles different colors I feel like you need a dark wash and a lighter wash cropped full length um, so I just love jeans but there is definitely a shape that I think is 
worth looking at if you want to update your jeans um, and you want to kind of give your jeans wardrobe a bit of a refresh and that is a barrel leg or a balloon style jean and I know a lot of people don't love these jeans um, and if a balloon or a barrel leg um, isn't for you then go for something that is relaxed something that has a wider leg um, barrel leg jeans or balloon jeans are going to be really big for 2024 so it is going to be a style that we are going to see a lot of not just in jeans but in pants as well um, but I just love the fit of it I think it's a style that really goes with any type of shoe whether that is an ankle boot ballet flat loafer sneaker um, so it's really versatile in that sense but I just find that whenever I wear my balloon jeans no matter what I style it with the outfit always feels very on trend and it just injects a bit of a modern touch to the outfit. So in this outfit I just wanted to emphasize the jeans so I just paired the balloon jeans with some black ankle boots and a cashmere um, black roll neck and just this outfit on its own looks really really chic um, and all of these pieces are classic but just the shape of the jeans makes the outfit feel a bit more current. So my favorite style of jean at the moment um, and definitely one to have a look at um, as a new more trendy style of jean. The next category is jackets. Now there are so many different styles of jackets out there. We have bomber jackets, blazers, puffer jackets but I think a style that really dominated this past season, actually the past couple of seasons, is a cropped lady jacket. Something that just feels a bit more feminine and I think it works really well with all of the wider leg trousers, the more baggy jeans that we've been seeing so it was just a nice juxtaposition um, and I think it's just an easy way to update your work wardrobe or your casual outfits and the one that I'm wearing in this outfit, this beautiful camel jacket, is actually from a brand called Maison Marais and it's from W Concept. Now, it's this video isn't sponsored by W Concept, but they kindly sent me a few of their pieces. So they are an online retailer that has quite a big range of brands and the pieces are just really beautifully curated and really whatever you're looking for you can find on their website and I was really really impressed with their outerwear the quality the fit the design was just really really impeccable so this is one of their jackets as I said from Maison Marais and I just love everything about this jacket it is that cropped style slightly more fitted um, what we have been seeing in these lady jackets but it has a really strong shoulder so it has a touch of a masculine style which is personally something I love. I love to add a bit of masculinity to all my outfits so I really love the strong shoulder and then the gold buttons which just elevate it and I think this is just such a beautiful jacket. Something different than a blazer. This one is also a wool jacket so perfect for winter and one that I think I'm going to get a lot of wear out of as I said so versatile you can wear it for work you can wear it for casual um, and you can layer all of these little thin knits underneath the third category that I look at when I want to update my winter wardrobe is coats and I am such a big coat lover and I think it's just one of the best wardrobe pieces for winter. I just love a good coat. Um, so this past season actually we're still in winter so at the moment there are two styles of coats that we have been seeing a lot of. So the first coat is this scarf coat. So last season and the season before we saw a lot of those scarf jackets specifically from Totem they started the whole scarf jacket um, trend um, and then we saw it trickle into coats as well and I think it just adds such a beautiful element to a coat. Obviously the coat is more relaxed and oversized but I think this added scarf detail makes it just feel very elevated while still being cozy um, and I showed this coat on Instagram recently and all of 
my followers over there loved it um so i think you will love it as well it's in this beautiful dark gray melange really really beautiful coat and i love the fact that it is so oversized because it means that i can do a lot of layering underneath and this one is specifically from kinder salmon um also from w concept and it's one of my favorites and great for casual and for work as well then the other style of coat that we've been seeing a lot of are these long length more masculine style coats um, and as i said earlier i love introducing more masculine elements into my outfits especially during fall and winter i tend to go for more feminine pieces in spring and summer but winter i love those androgynous touches um, and those masculine style elements so this coat i've also shown on instagram it's from a brand called danced on w concept and honestly this coat is just everything the fit of it is just exquisite i'm actually wearing a size small um i went for a small instead of an extra small because i wanted it slightly more oversized so that i have room for layering it's in this beautiful herringbone fabric the color is really gorgeous it's this brownie taupey color which i didn't have anything like that in my wardrobe and i think it's just a nice alternative to a really dark coat we have the strong shoulders and what i love about it is the length um i'm just under five foot four but it can be really tricky for me to find very long coats because i find most of the time they're just way too long so this one is a really good length on me and one that again you can do casually or you can do for work and it's just one of those styles that will be forever in my wardrobe and i will bring it out every single season the next category is shoes and if there's one style of shoe that everyone associates with winter then it is a good pair of boots and there's a specific style that we've been seeing for the last couple of years that's really big again this year and i think we're gonna see it for the next few years to come and that is more of a square toe so it's still a longer elongated toe but it has that square shape we are seeing a lot of pointed toe boots as well but i think that square shape is what really just adds a great modern touch to any outfit and if you are looking at going for a boot in a more modern style then that is a nice way to update all of your other outfits because a black boot is something that you can wear with most outfits and if it's a modern shape then it'll kind of add a modern twist to everything that you style it with and the ones that i'm showing here one has more of a flat heel so if you're looking for something maybe slightly more casual or that's good for just everyday wear then that is a great option you can also go for a kitten heel if you want it to be a bit more workwear appropriate kitten heels have also been really big so that is another kind of trendy element to this boot um but you will see me style these boots in all of the outfits and i think they're just one of those staples that all of us need in our wardrobe a good pair of black ankle boots and if you go for more of a modern shape then it will update all of your outfits categories of accessories that i focused on to update my winter wardrobe and similar to the boots an accessory is a really easy way to update all of your outfits for instance jewelry or a bag or belt you wear it almost every single day so if you go for something that feels a bit more current then it will update whatever you wear it with so the what the first category that i focused on was bags i think it's something that most of us wear every single day we saw a lot of these big more slouchy tote bags but then we also saw a lot of structured box bags and personally i love a good structured bag because you can wear it casually but you can also make it work for something that feels a bit more formal workwear a bit more dressy so this bag is actually also from w concept from a brand called the maker and the quality is just absolutely beautiful i posted it on instagram the other day and so many of you wanted to know where it was from so i will link it down below as well it's just such a beautiful 
everyday bag i love the box shape it definitely reminds me of old celine um it has three compartments so you can actually fit a ton into it great everyday bag the strap is adjustable you can wear it either as a shoulder bag or a crossbody bag for something a bit more casual i also love the gold hardware it makes a bit of a statement but it's not too overpowering and the leather is just beautiful it has a bit of texture to it so you won't see any scratches or nicks on the surface and I think this is just a great bag to update your winter wardrobe with and then the other category that I kind of focused on quite a lot was earrings now I never leave the house without my earrings. I feel completely naked if I don't have earrings on. Um, so I love a good earring. And kind of this trend started last summer already. Um, and that is beautiful, big, vintage inspired earrings. Um, and it was still big for full. It's still big now and it's not going anywhere. We're going to see a lot of these um, styles of earrings in spring and summer as well um, and I think it just really updates any outfit you can wear a pair of jeans and just a blazer like I'm doing now and then you're wearing a bold like vintage inspired earring and it just feels updated and kind of current and on trend so it's a nice affordable way to update your existing wardrobe um, and then you can kind of play around with how big you want you can go for something like this which isn't too big or the other ones that I'm showing you which is slightly more bold so great for a more dressy look or not you can also do that with like a white shirt and jeans but I love these big earrings um, big bold and chunky earrings um, so another one of my focuses for updating my winter wardrobe and that is it for today's video i will link everything in the description box down below especially those pieces from w concept i also have a discount code um so it's sancha 2024 that will give you some discount and they also have an app that is newly launched and i believe you can get 15 percent off if you shop through their app I will just double check and I will leave all of the information in the description box down below um, so you can definitely go and have a look there and if you have any questions on the fit or the sizing you can always ask me in the comments but I will link my sizes down below as well and I hope you enjoyed this video I hope it was helpful in case you are running out of inspiration or you feel like everything you bought last year kind of feels old and you want to update it um, then I think I gave you a good selection of kind of pieces that you can focus on and if you just want to add one of these pieces to your wardrobe then as I said it will immediately feel a bit more updated so that is it for today's video if you haven't already please like and subscribe I would love for you to join the styled family and also go and give me a follow over on Instagram I share even more style inspiration tips outfit inspiration over there so definitely go and give me a follow and I will see you again in the next video. Bye.